What's up, you guys? My name is Mary. I'm with High Priestess Intuition. Welcome, my first subscribers, and welcome, 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 newbies. If you guys are new to my channel and you enjoy my content, you can smash the sub button to be notified for future readings. This is free general collective reading for all signs, path to inside you, everybody in between. Don't forget the basics. Time is fluid. Energy is fluid. If it doesn't apply, let it fly. Everyone has free will. Only take the messages that resonate. Leave the rest. Free general collective reading. Love and appreciate each and every one of you guys. Thanks for all the recent donations. Um, if you'd like to book a personal reading, the information is in the description box below. I have two, uh, two offerings. Um, if I have a new service called Life Coaching. If anybody's interested in that, the link's in the description box below. Um, and yeah, there was something else and I forgot it. <laughs> oh, um, th uh, thanks for all the new subscribers. That too, yeah. Um, love you guys so much. Okay, so I was in my spiritual bath, just chillaxing, man. And it was so, I wasn't going to do any more readings tonight. Y'all know they've just been flowing in all day, all literally all day. I was been doing, doing them between personal readings, personal readings. And this is what I've been doing literally all day long. Um, but it's because they keep flowing in. So, you know, some days it's like that and some it's not. Um, and I like to offload them when I get them. Some, some readers write them down. But if I'm here and I can offload them, then I offload them. Now, if I'm out, it's a different story. Like when I was driving home this morning, um, I wrote them down. Um, but I'm here. So they are just flowing in. So we're doing it. Okay. So only take the messages that resonate and leave the rest. If they, it doesn't fit, don't force it. Okay. Okay. So the channel message I received was a dark arts wielder. And I heard they have, were wielded for many years. They got addicted to it. Um, I heard it's air sign. It's air sign. I heard through, and I feel this could be a mass scorpion air sign. They can have Gemini, Libra, Aquarius, and any aspects of their charts. But it is an air sign. And they got addicted to dark arts wielding. So they either currently wield dark arts or they used to do it and they did it for a long time. How that resonates and applies. Only you know who this dark arts air sign is, not anybody else. I don't, I feel for majority of my collective, it's not you. I think it's somebody you know, dark arts air sign. But I will tell you, I don't think it's a young buck. I don't think it's somebody like 25 or below. I think it's an older person, like 35, 36 or above, because they have been wielding dark arts for a long time. So I'm feeling like um, five or five plus years or, I didn't hear specifically the time frame on it. That's just intuitively what I'm feeling. Like five, five plus years or something like that. So I don't feel there's no young buck. I don't think they're 25 or below. I think they are like 35, 36 or above or 26 or above or something like that. And the other reason I think they're older is because of the channel message. And you'll understand why when I deliver. Okay. All right. So, but they've been wielding dark arts a long time. Uh, they got addicted to it. Now, whether they're currently still doing it or not, only they know this, not anybody else. But I heard soon through many shocking series of chain events, they're about to find out they have emphysema soon. I heard it's going to shock the hell out of them, um, but I heard it shouldn't because they have a long history of smoking. Um, so I heard smoking. So, you know, that could be different, many things. Smoking, that could be cigarettes, that could be crack, that could be weed, that could be two or two plus of these things. It could be anything else that's smokable. Uh, whatever the hell else is smokable. I know crack is smokable, which I I don't do drugs. I don't do those kind of drugs, but I used to work in a jail. That's how I know that. I know crack is smokable. I know weed is smokable and cigarettes. But anything that is smokable, and apparently they've been smoking for a long time. So I heard through many series of chain events soon, unexpected, shocking series of chain events, they're about to find out they have emphysema. But I heard they're going to be shocked, but they shouldn't be shocked because they've been smoking a long time. So like I said, is that weed? Is that cigarettes? Is that crack? Is that something else that's smokable? Or whatever, whatever. But they've been inhaling something and smoking it for a long time. So they shouldn't be shocked, basically. Because they're inhaling some kind of substance, and they have been for a long time, into their lungs. Their al alveoli, their lung sacs. I mean, that's common sense. <laughs> but you plugging in how it resonates. Okay, so when I got this channeling, because I was in my spiritual bath and I got it. I just got out. That's why I'm in my robe. My hair is all soaked and all that. So I looked this up because I learned about emphysema and signs and symptoms and all that in nursing school. But my God, it's been a long time since I've been in nursing school. A long time. So I had to look this up, okay? 
So through many shocking series of chain events, they're about to find out they have emphysema, right? Okay, so we're going to go over this <laughs> because I think for my, the reason I'm getting this is because you guys are about to, I think you guys know this person. And I think you're about to sit, hear that this person has emphysema or you're, or, or maybe you're a doctor and they come in, they have emphysema and you diagnose them or you're a family or friend or somebody on a ball team or something who find out they have emphysema. I mean, there's a reason I'm getting it is what I'm saying. Okay, what are the symptoms of emphysema? Frequent coughing or wheezing, a cough that produces a lot of mucus. So very mucus, mu a lot of mucosa basically. Shortness of breath, especially with physical activity. So shortness of breath upon exertion. Whistling or squeaky sound when you breathe. Tightness in your chest. As your emphysema gets worse, you may notice loss of appetite, depression, problems having sex, sleep problems, blue nails or lip beds, which is cyanosis for anybody who doesn't know that, fatigue, frequent lung infections, morning headaches. The main symptom of emphysema is shortness of breath, which usually begins gradually. You may start avoiding activities that cause you to be short of breath, so the symptom doesn't become a problem until it starts interfering with daily tasks. Emphysema eventually causes shortness of breath, uh, even when you're at rest. So, meaning shortness of breath, shortness of breath with non-exertion. You're not doing anything. You're not doing things physically to cause to be out of breath. That's non-exertion. I was trying to look up some better pertinent information. Overinflation of lungs also. Signs and symptoms of emphysema take years to develop, but once they start, they generally include shortness of breath, coughing with mucus, wheezing. Okay. Yeah, I think that's the pertinent information there. Okay, so yeah, so... I think confirmation for my phone, by the way. So I think one of you guys is about to find out somebody has emphysema or you're about to see the symptoms uh, manifest in somebody is what I feel. Um, you plug it in how it resonates. Confirmation of my phone. Uh, I'll see if I hear anything else. I'm not really going to pull any. I mean, I'm, I might pull a couple, but um, let's see. Let me Google search one thing real quick regarding this, and then we'll keep with the reading. Let's see. Okay, okay, so if y'all were wondering, I looked up, I Google searched, is coughing up blood a symptom of em emphysema, so hemophytiasis basically, because if y'all remember in the beginning channel message I received this morning, hemophytiasis was a symptom of a black magic wheel, um, and it's about to be a lot of blood, hemophytiasis, that's coughing up blood. So I Google searched, is coughing up blood a symptom of emphysema? Because now I'm pulling emphysema with the black magic wielder. So I was wondering if it was the same person. Um, but I'm seeing, here's what I'm getting. C causes of coughing up blood, COPD, chronic obstructive pulmonary disease, and lung cancer. So I'm not seeing, hold on, hold on, hold on a second.
Okay. I'm not. I'm not. I was trying to figure out if the hemopatiasis of popping up blood is congruent with um, with um, emphysema. It doesn't seem like it is. COPD, COPD, and lung cancer. So um, popping up blood is not congruent with emphysema. Uh, yellow mucus, clear mucus, and um, short, shortness of breath upon exertion and non-exertion and all that, but not hemopatiasis, which is the coughing up of blood. So. Um, just saying. One of these people does not smoke, and they're about to find out they have it too. Air sign as well. Oh my God! Black magic wielder too. Oh my God! Okay, so one of these. Okay, so there's two of them. Two air signs. Two Gemini Libra Aquariuses. Um, black magic wielders. It's backfiring in the form of medical condition or conditions. One of them does not smoke, and it doesn't sound like they have a history of smoking. So I'm assuming that's anything. And one does. Emphysema strong. Holy crap. So one doesn't have a history of smoking. I wonder if they have a history of being around secondhand smoke, possibly. But no, but they don't have a history of smoking. But this this person does. And they may smoke right now, uh, like right now in the energetic space. You plug it in how it resonates. Man. But both light magic wielders, for sure. Spirit messages you have reflective. The intellect reversed. Endurance reversed. I think that's from the um her take them. I think that's from um, endurance reverse is their health is about to decline with this emphysema. I think this is the shortness shortness of breath upon exertion at the beginning. And then when it gets worse, shortness of breath upon breath, non-exertion. I mean, like their health is about to start declining in a huge way. Healing reverse. I mean, their body, they may have a, a suppressed immune system and their body cannot heal as fast as it used to. Um Yikes. I mean, I don't think they're going to recover from this. Oh, I don't, well, emphysema is not something, once you get it, it progresses. But, um, yeah, this is health defining. Healing reverse. Health is about to start defining. And there's two two air signs. One smokes or used to smoke, has a history of smoking, and one has no history of smoking and doesn't smoke. Both air signs, Gemini, Libra, Aquarius, and I feel they're older as type air signs. The intellect reverse, endurance reverse. These people were so jealous of a feminine energy in the, in the past, so jealous, and wanted to manifest her in so bad to do their bidding. Use black magic to do it, but now it's about to backfire on their own bodies. Oh my God. Okay, I heard these uh, these air signs. So there's at least two of them in the universe. You have to plug it in how it resonates. I heard they were so jealous of a feminine energy in the past and they wanted to manifest her in for basically them to do their bidding. So doing control tactics to do what they wanted her to do. And I heard they were jealous of her in the past. Uh, but... And they use black magic to do this, but whoever this femme energy is, she's either high in the spiritual realm or she became high in the spiritual realm, so she was able to ward off the dark arts. Um, so it's it's backfired on them, but it's backfired, and it can backfire on them, the wilder, or other people. In this case, it's backfiring on them, on their physical body, in the form of health condition, which is emphysema in this case. Um, this is sad. This is sad. Intellect reverse. They didn't use their head. They used their emotions, their feels, jealousy, control tactics, domineering tactics in the past. And now, and they, so since they did, they decided to call on the dark forces to do it. So now this is what they get in the form of their own body. This is terrible. I would, I don't care where my life went. I would never call on the dark forces, but that's just me. Oh, man. Endurance reverse. A fire sign is about to see this manifest, and an earth sign is about to see this manifest. 
on these air signs quickly. It is about to scare the hell out of them. Official diagnosis coming soon. Oh, God. This, yikes. Okay. So there's at least two air signs in the universe this resonates with. I think you guys know this part, these people, or I think you know them, or they're people you're past or something. I don't feel for a lot of my collective, it's you. Uh, but you plug in and how it resonates. But, okay, I heard an earth sign and a fire sign is about to see this manifest on these people very soon. I heard it's about to scare the hell out of them. So Aries, Leo, Sagittarius, and a Taurus, Capricorn, Virgo, they're about to see it manifest on these people. One ha is a smoker or a former smoker and a history of smoking. One is not a former smoker, no history of smoking, and doesn't smoke. But these people, this fire sign, Aries, Leo, Sag, or this Taurus, Capricorn, Virgo, is about to see it manifest on these people soon, and it's about to scare the hell out of them. So they didn't use their brain They to, when they used all uh, the dark arts. But it's about to come back in the form of medical conditions. We got an earth sign and fire sign about to see this shit. They're about to get scared as hell. And I heard official diagnosis coming soon. So I think these people are about to get so ill. They're about to have to go to a doctor or a urgent care or ER or something of that nature. Because I'm feeling they might start getting so short of breath or coughing up or wheezing or coughing uncontrollably to the point they need medical attention because they're, I'm feeling their O2 sats are probably going to drop real low. Or they might start getting cyanotic with blue fingertips and blue lips and blue external, like your nose or your, your tips of your ears or your fingertips and your toes. Because trust me, as being a nurse so long, that's how it manifests uh, when your O2 sat levels are real low. Just trust me. Um, or something of that nature. I think their O2 sats is about to drop so low that they're probably going to have to um, either go to an urgent care, uh, make a doctor's appointment. Well, if it's O2 sats dropping real low, I'm feeling emergency room or urgent care. Probably ER. Um, but we've got some, at least two people about to see this manifest. A fire sign and earth sign. Now, I don't know if these people are going to cart them to the ER, cart them to the urgent care. And a water sign. And a water sign. Okay, fire sign, earth sign, water sign. Taurus, Capricorn, Virgo, Aries, Leo, Sag, and a um, Cancer, Pisces, Scorpio about to see this. And an air sign. And an air sign. Okay, well, we've got all signs. We got all signs over here. It's a it's a towel. It's a towel. We got all signs over here about to see this manifest. So, like I said, I don't know if these people are being friends, family members, community members, whoever, whoever. I don't know if they're gonna cart them to the ER, if they're home health, if they're hospital, well, not hospice, if they're home health, if they're um uh family members, friends, whoever, whoever, and they're about to to hopefully take some action, take them to the ER, take them to urgent care, or, or get a, buy an O2 sat monitor for their home if they live with them, and start checking. However that resonates. Yo, man, this is terrible. But they definitely didn't use their head in the past with dark arts, because this is why all this shit's manifesting. I heard official diagnosis coming soon, so I think one of these people is about to have to go to urgent care, have to go to the ER. I think they're about to get so short of breath, and their O2 sats are about to drop so low, they're about to have to take some action, and these people are about to see it manifest. I think these people are about to help them get somewhere. Um, hopefully, to get some medical treatment. Oh, my God. Endurance reversed. Their health is about to severely decline, and it's not going to get better after this. Okay, I heard their health is about to severely decline, it's, and it's not going to get better after this. This is terrible. So endurance reversed. Um, I think this is the shortness of, shortness of breath energy here with the um, with the emphysema, and I'm serious. I heard their health is about to severely decline. It's not going to get better. So wheezing, o, low O2 sats, um, coughing up phlegm, shortness of breath all the time. First, upon exertion in the beginning stages of emphysema, in the later latter stages, it's shortness of breath with non-exertion. I mean, health, and I heard it's not going to get better. And emphysema, once you get it, it, you know, it's not something you can just treat and boom, you're better. I mean, to my knowledge, I'm just saying. So, wow. So, I mean, their health is about to decline, and I heard it in the spiritual download, it's not going to get better. So, I feel some of these people, they're not already in good health. And it's about to start getting worse. 
is what I feel. I think they have prior medical condition or conditions and it's about to compound upon this and it's going to make it worse is what I feel, intuitively feel. But you plug it in how it resonates. We have endurance reversed. I don't feel these people are already in con good condition, medical condition, and I'm just being serious. For some, maybe not good mental health. Maybe for some, both. For one of these people, they are about to be so ill. They're about to be uh, housebound. They're not going to be able to be able to get out and interact with the public like they used to. They will be housebound. Oh, my God. It is about to be that bad. Oh, my God. I heard it's about to be that bad. Okay, so, for, so one of these people is about to decline their health horribly. I mean, for some intuitive reason, I'm feeling this the shortness of breath about to get them. And I'm serious. I didn't hear this. I just intuitively feel it's about... Something is about to take them down so bad, they're about to be homebound. And I heard they're not going to be able to get out, interact with the public like they used to, and it's about to permanently homebound them. Meaning, if they work, it might have to be work from home. Um, but I think it's because of the shortness of breath or the wheezing. or some, It's something to do with their lungs and breathe, the breathing capacity. Um, they're not going to be able to... Uh, have the endurance, the endurance to walk or, well, I don't know if they'll be, I don't know. I don't know. I don't know. I'm just telling you spiritual downloads. I, I don't know. I can't assess this person. I'm just reading the energy here. Yo, man, this, but however that resonates, one of these people is going to be so bad, they will be homebound. So I think they interact with po public eye energy right now, um, out in the 3D, the public, and Basically, it's about to decline their health so bad, they're going to have to be homebound. So if they work out in the public, have a business or businesses, or they are employed somewhere, it sounds like they're going to have to switch it to home if they still want to be employed or have business or businesses. If they do. For some of these people, they might be unemployed. But that's just for one of them. And I heard it's not getting any better. So... I mean, you plug in how it resonates. All right, I'm getting out of this. I love you guys. Namaste.